Stay Human, my band, we're going to have a good time. You know, we always like to transform a venue and give people an experience once in a lifetime. What we call the music is a, a live musical experience. So we always come to the venue that we go to. It's always different because every venue is different and we try to figure out ways of transforming it so that everyone has an interactive experience. Going into the audience, coming from the balcony, just doing things, inviting people onto the stage. It's very cool. Yeah, yeah. moved here to New York City to go to Juilliard at 17, about eight and a half years ago. And now my band members and I, we all went to Juilliard and met there. And it's kind of been an experience playing with different people, you know, in jazz and otherwise. From Wynton Marsalis, I played with Prince, Lenny Kravitz, also playing with Cassandra Wilson and Harry Connick Jr., Jimmy Buffett. Just different musicians up until the point where I formed my own band and I was like, you know, this is the vibe, I want to go for that. You know, jazz is always changing. It's very modern. It's one of the things that, even though it's an older form and tradition from American music, it's always modern because it's happening right in the moment. And it's the most modern thing that you can have if it's happening right in front of you and being invented on the spot. So that's the thing that I think people enjoy about jazz once they get into it. And you don't have to know a whole lot about jazz to enjoy that. It's just spontaneous. <laughs> When me and the band are writing, I usually bring in ideas and come up with the, the structure or the arrangement if it's not an original composition. And then everyone kind of collaborates and contributes as it goes along and it morphs into the final product. But it's always a work in progress because we always like to keep things fresh and we adapt things to the venue, as I was saying before. So it's, it's always moving and evolving. It's very collaborative and I like it that way. Yeah. Jazz doesn't express any different emotions than any other form of music, but what it does for me is gives me that kind of way of expressing those emotions that I really enjoy. And I think it has a unique way of expressing those emotions because there's such a group interplay. It's like three or four or five or ten people at the same time, and they're speaking to each other and creating spontaneously in the moment. I'll be rich as the Rockefeller With gold dust at my feet On the sunny side of the street I couldn't imagine that I would be here uh, 10 years ago or even longer than that, even shorter than that, five years ago. But I think that's the fun part about life. You don't know where you're going to end up. You just do your best and try to figure out your direction. The great musicians of any genre seem to have that kind of a singular focus and one-mindedness about their vision. They know what they want and they know how to get to it. So I think that's a really important lesson to learn whatever you decide to do.